Hey there, my name is Erin and let me take you on a journey with me to the place called Japan. Oh wow, who is that? It's me again, yeah, nothing new here. So in today's exact video I would like to talk more about my trip to the Disneyland because some things except for that happened as well but like the Disneyland was crazily good like wow wow just wow and before i start i'm wearing a new lipstick i bought here in japan and it's like a tattoo or something like that so it's supposed to be staying in my lips for like a lot of time before i just remove it with the right the makeup remover i don't know about that just yet but i love the color it looks like that by the way if you're wondering so about the disneyland let me start from the very beginning and let me tell you that if it wasn't for my friend that was going to go there anyway i wouldn't go there myself and i would be a stupid idiot the disneyland was just amazing if you would like to define the word amazing that would be disneyland <laughs> like probably that would be so all the cartoons i watched in my childhood when i was a little kid and all of them were represented there like i loved peter pan especially and uh it was there it was an attraction about that but i haven't been there unfortunately so also all the other characters as well they were there and the atmosphere of the disneyland is amazing it's just something you experience one time and you can like never ever ever forget it we were walking across the disneyland a lot we took a lot of pictures of each other in front of the the main castle that was there also we've been riding different roller coasters and and even standing in the lines was like some great of an experience because you know like at some attractions there were like lines inside of the building so it was air conditioning and we were feeling absolutely comfortable but in some of them in some of them we were staying like outside but it still was amazing because it was a part of the attraction or something like that so the western style for example we were standing for the big thunder mountain also the haunted mansion we were standing in the some kind of a garden in front in front of this attraction so it was also really cool and really thoughtful of people who made this and we really enjoyed it we bought ourselves t-shirts so let me show you mine yes you can see it it's pretty big like i wanted the oversized model because i don't know i like oversized things because i am oversized myself and uh i really enjoyed it and this t-shirt is great although it doesn't like help me during the summer heat and i'm still very sweaty everywhere but like it's still great i love this t-shirt so also when it was closing and when it was coming to the night time first of all we bought ourselves a popcorn but just not just a popcorn a random popcorn it was a curry flavored popcorn and it was great just let me tell you great the greatest popcorn i've ever tried first of all it was so special because i've never tried like curry popcorn before because because wow i haven't seen it anywhere but in japan and after i tried it it was just like wow like the best popcorn of all so we watched the parade and i almost cried because i saw all the characters were moving i'll probably insert a lot of footage in here all the characters were moving and they were going slowly they were singing songs they were saying some phrases and i saw them all and i felt like a kid again like after that i was just like wow this thing is amazing like i would be totally idiot to not go there and thanks like lots of things to my friend that asked me to go with them so yeah that was great experience but about the roller coasters itself like i think it was nice and it was fine for the disneyland itself because it was a disney sea as well in tokyo here and the roller coasters weren't that crazy that scary i would say so only the space mountain was pretty scary to both me and my friends so 
we were quite scared and it was like this feeling like, like you're jumping off this roller coaster all of a sudden. But like all of the other ones, nah. They were interesting. The Pirates of the Caribbean, they were just great. All those like figures like moving their faces and they are just like natural people. Like wow. I've been to the attraction park in London when I was there and I saw something like that, but here it's absolutely different from the one that I saw there. But their attractions were scarier, if I might say that. And also the Haunted Mansion, so the one with the ghosts and everything, it wasn't that scary to me, but like, again, the technique or of doing that the way it is, it was so cool, it was so great. I don't know, I can't even explain it, it's just, it's, it's, it's master's work. I didn't know it was possible to make it like that, to make it go like that, but it was, it indeed was. And although the attractions weren't that scary, but like all the atmosphere, all the Disney-like spirit, and all the characters, and we watched two more parades during the day also. There was music playing, like people dancing, and there were splashing water around, so we were like, we weren't that hot when we were, were walking over there. Because it was quite hot, I got sunburned. Yeah. And the adults were dancing like kids over there, so I'm sure they were feeling the best of themselves. About the attractions I liked the most, the Space Mountain, first of all, because it was the scariest one and it was in a dark and it was like rolling around really fast. Also, I liked the Splash Mountain or something like that, where there is a lot of water everywhere and you just go on the boat like that. And then you just, one moment you just fall down and it feels like you're falling down into the water, but it's not really that. <laughs> this is like the water drops touch you a little bit, but it's not like you're falling down to the water, but it feels like it. I have a picture from there, by the way, <laughs> you can look at it right now. After we went to this mountain, my main slogan after that was like, Japanese thought it through, so there's three words because we took our backpacks with us in there and it, we were allowed to, to take them, but it was like watery and everything, so it was like, well, are we going to get wet? We probably are going to get wet and everything, but like, if they allow to take like our luggage with us, probably it wouldn't be that wet. We did get wet ourselves a little bit, but like our luggage was fine, <laughs> like perfectly fine. So Japanese thought it through, remember it, remember it kids. If you go to Japan, Japanese thought it through for you. Just don't, don't you worry, don't you worry kid. Then I also like the Pirates of the Caribbean because it was so naturally moving and the story itself and it was like stunned like that when I just went out of this attraction. So again, as I said already, the Disneyland is kind of for kids and for and for adults as well. So it isn't that scary, it isn't like that impressive if it comes to the thrill or something like that. So if you're looking for something thrilling, I advise you to go to Disney Sea because it's stated to be for adults only. If you're looking for like wild attractions, I think you should visit the Disney Sea instead of Disneyland. And if you're looking for the atmosphere, I think the Disneyland is the best option for you. And we went to the Disneyland during Uminohi, which is the day of the ocean or something. And today now here it's currently Wednesday, so nothing much exciting happened during like the Tuesday and the Wednesday. Like the only thing that happened is someone took my vocabulary and I didn't prepare for my kanji test today. <laughs> so today I got it back, so everything's fine. Oh, and also today me and my friend we went to Harajuku again to eat some sweet, things in there but we were quite disappointed because like sadly enough I don't have a photo of this thing but it's like a dessert and the representation of it it looks like a big like fat wow like good looking dessert and when they give it to you it looks like you know two times smaller and it doesn't look that great any anyway and like and mm, I don't know it's quite disappointing. <laughs> we then went on walking on the streets so we went to a couple of shops. It was a pet shop where they were selling like so cute like pet clothings and it's like Disney characters again 
and also all the different ones like kimono ones and the hats as well and it was really cute and I was so sorry I don't have like a little dog that I could dress up or something I just have a big doggy that doesn't like all this shit then we went to a cosmetic store where we spent a lot of time and effort like finding the best lipstick for ourselves and I got this one and my friend got another one so and after that I went here and nothing else happened probably yeah so that's pretty much it for my video I hope you liked it and enjoyed it and the next video will be about something else I guess so if you don't want to miss on it just like subscribe or check out my playlist a place called Japan and watch other videos I think they're fine average I don't know <laughs> so thank you so much for watching this video I hope you liked it and enjoyed it and see you and I'll see you soon from the place called Japan